Hello everyone. Um, today I decided to help my little sister with her science fair project. I will be using a couple of batteries and many people you know that just using any kind of copper wire you can obviously, you know, light up a bulb or create a circuit. I use something like this. You can probably use like an 18 gauge copper wire. Some of them are insulated so you'll just tap off the little insulation on the edges. Otherwise, you can just peel something off like this and have a little figure, which I will show you in a little bit. Um, besides the battery, I bought something called neodymium, neodymium or neodymium magnets. These magnets are possibly maybe ten times stronger than your regular fridge magnet. I have a few of these, and these I bought at Walmart. They're maybe like dollars for four of them. So I'm going to be using a few of them just to make it a little bit taller and exciting. I'm going to put it under the battery like this. I don't know how much I've drained out of the battery, but they go pretty fast with this. This is called a homopolar motor. Um, the battery and then the magnets, of course, the magnet field is going to interact with the field already created in the circuit by putting the copper wire around it. So anytime there's a perpendicular circuit, it's going to create a torque, which is going to make it eventually spin. I put this little thing on the top. I don't know if you can see it. And um, just to kind of create a balance on the top, you can just play with the wire, figure out which shape you would like to make. I obviously made a little heart with a little flower. Um, so let's try it to the test. And let's balance it on there. And maybe it's a little crooked. Okay, maybe not. Come on. Maybe this battery's drained. Let me just try one more because the wire will get hot, so I do feel it hot. So there must have been battery left. It's probably the shape of my little thing here. Try this again. And there you go. Good night, everyone. Thank you.